my friends, welcome back to Hoogie Place. Welcome to Gommel in Belarus. As you see, we are uh, at the same place as where we uh, unloaded in the last video. Now we will uh, just uh, move over to another another parking spot here, <coughs> and uh, there we will uh, load up the trailer with uh, flowers flowers in pots or something like that and uh, we will deliver these flowers in the capital of Ukraine in Kiev so we will cross the border today the border to Ukraine and if the roads has been okay here in Belarus they will probably be probably be much worse in Kiev. At least that's my um, experience of that country. Uh, and uh, also, Kiev uh, on the uh, Eurotruck map can be a little tricky because it can give you. Um, a lot of stuttering and uh, graphic problems so I hope that we will avoid that but I cannot uh, promise anything we will see when we get there now it's uh, reversing in place here that is on the menu and, uh, I lined up quite good now it's just to reverse straight, perhaps put myself a little bit more to uh, my left, and that is what you see is a right here. That looks good. So just straighten it out here. And yes, we will uh, load up the trailer with uh, flowers. Then it's good with the Frigo trailer because flowers should be transported, not frozen, but uh, a little, a little cold. And we are loading here. Unloaded we are. So let's take a look at the map from uh, Gommel down south to Kiev. We will pass Chernobyl. So, Bengt, I will try to um, get to Chernobyl uh, in another video. 226 kilometers to travel. We will uh, hopefully reach our destination in one piece uh, tonight. So, uh, we better get going. And. Um, Yes, I hope that the roads will be better than the last time I drove in uh, Ukraine. But as I said, I cannot promise anything. I'm not the road manager here. Uh, Kiev, a big city far from 3 million inhabitants 2.8 2.9 somewhere so uh, yeah it's quite big but I'm not sure that you will notice uh, the greatness of the city in this game I'm not sure that they have uh, created it like they have for example with this place where you see a lot of buildings around you but uh, as I said we will uh, see when we get there and talking about getting there we are on our way now so uh, I hope that you will follow me on the journey and that you will enjoy the ride so uh, sit back and relax and I'll see you in Kiev
one more road work um, and um, so far it has gone well I hope that you have noticed <laughs> the, the quality of the roads here it's like going on a roller coaster in different places and this is not a good sight looks like we have an accident or something like that this is also typical when you drive in uh, place, places like these uh, when I say places like these I mean in uh, this area of the map there is often incidents like this where the AI drivers uh, behave st stupidly and uh, I think that I will behave stupidly as well here I have two options one is to stand here and wait for nothing and one is to actually break the law drive against red light and try to squeeze myself uh, through beside this truck and the car that is in front because otherwise I can be standing here the whole night and I don't want that and this actually looks like if it's gonna work it's tight but it's doable and this is actually a thing with a game that I don't like uh, that the AI driver and you see like this one too the AI drivers behave uh, like this that is not good so uh, I hope that they will uh, sometime in the future uh, get rid of that error because I I see it more like an error of course there are stupid drivers in r reality as well but not in that way perhaps so we are uh, we are through and we are on our way to Kiev again, so uh, sit back and relax and we'll see each other in Kiev.
we are in the big city, Kiev. We have reached our destination here. Um, this is a uh, store. And we will park here at the back side of this building. And as I said earlier, I have uh, changed in the config file so that I will get uh, not only the easiest parking option. Because if I would have had the easiest parking option, I would not uh, have to go down this slope here. But there is uh, one very good thing with this and that is that I have a lot of space to move around so I can line up like this. So therefore it shouldn't be too much problem to, uh, to get down there. I need to get a little bit, bit more to my right. So if I turn, yeah, uh, looks good. Make my truck go a little bit to the right and then the trailer will turn right and then straighten it up again like this. Looks like looks like I'm doing well. This is actually <laughs> not as easy as it looks like but uh, try the rigid chassis and tandem trailer out and you will uh, notice of course I'm not the best driver but it's actually not easy but I will get there eventually you will have to be patient Well, we have come to Kiev at least, that is good, and um, I uh, am grateful for you coming with me all the way. Thank you for uh, your patience and thank you for coming with me from Gommel to uh, Kiev. Please subscribe if you want to keep updated with more upcoming videos, leave a comment if you have any and perhaps hit the like button. I am soon ready here and after this I will take a break until it's time to find a load out of Kiev. In place, unloading and uh, getting the payment and then we are ready. Until the next time my friends, take care, bye bye.